I'm Tom from Do-It-Yourself Home Automation, and this is a look at changing the watch faces on the Fitbit Versa smartwatch. So you can see in the little camera view in the upper left that I have a different custom watch face on my watch right now. And I'm just gonna show how you can go and switch that out for all of the different watch faces that are offered. Um, so let's take a look now at the app itself for Fitbit, which I've launched on my phone. So here I am in the app, um, and I'm gonna press on the little uh, head thing in the upper left there that brings up my account. Now I'm gonna go in and I'm going to select my Versa smartwatch. And you can see now that I'm in here, it says link Fitbit with Versa, I'll say okay. So it's gonna sync them together and that allows me to immediately make changes on my watch. Um, now I'm gonna go into clock faces. And it's showing me what my current clock face is. And you saw that on the camera view, that is in fact what's displaying on the watch. So now I'm gonna go into all clocks over on the right. And now I have options for all different designs for my watch face. So I can scroll down, I can scroll through these. Um, the first set is the ones from Fitbit. So these are probably a little bit more polished and official. Um, and it'll load here in a minute. You can see there's all different designs on here. Um, analog kinds of watches, ones that are very sort of digital like chronograph over there. Um, the default is layers. I don't really like that one. Uh, it kind of makes me feel like I'm getting double vision or something. That's why I switched to a different one. Um, but you can go through and select all different kinds and you can see they display different kinds of information. So some are just the time, some of them have steps, heart rate, that kind of thing. I chose the simple watch face. Um, so these are the Fitbit designs, but you can also look at staff picks. There's um, custom faces for specific things like LGBTQ Pride Month. You could choose a rainbow design. Um, and then they have these different categories of digital or stats heavy where you can get all of your stats from the, uh, the home screen analog if you want to have it look kind of like an old-fashioned watch or a Swiss watch or something you can do that um, and then there's recently added down at the bottom or you can scroll through everything that they've got and certain clock faces are uh, free to put in other ones you do have to pay a little bit for so I usually start and recommend other people start with the buy Fitbit section which is where you'll find the ones that are sort of the more official try those out um, and if you want to switch you go into a specific one, so I'll take a look at chronograph. I'll say select, and I'm gonna say install, and then it's gonna sync with my Fitbit Versa. And it's gonna download that watch face to the smartwatch. And you wanna make sure that you leave a little time here because it has to download it from Fitbit, and then it has to sync it over to the watch and install it. And I believe it probably restarts the watch. So I just felt a little vibration on my wrist. The watch is restarting. And then I'll pull up the camera again and show you what the new watch face looks like. So you can see my watch has been uh, swatched, switched out. And uh, now it's that chronograph uh, swapped out there. And um, that's uh, the way that you change your watch face on the Fitbit Versa. Now the same basic process should apply to the Ionic as well if you want to change watch faces there. I'm um, just demonstrating this on the Versa today. Uh, if you found this helpful in any way, please subscribe to my channel. It really helps.